Hi, I'm Teddy Burris, your Google Workspace and Gmail strategist, trainer, and coach. And I'm going to answer this question today. Can I take text from a Google Doc and paste it directly in a WordPress blog? But before I show you how to do this, hit that subscribe button because I have a whole lot more content coming out on using Google Workspace and Gmail as business tools. So I wrote this document. And I was just I was playing around with uh, under tools uh, voice typing and it's not really for me it's hard to get used to but it's worth testing but anyway I wrote this document right here and I want to move this document over into my WordPress blog now you can also see I've got some italics here and I put some, make some bold here let's go up top here and put some bold in here so you can see bold and I'll put some underline here organically intertwined network makes an underline and so you see some different fonts in here I'll put a headline in here let's see this is the test I'll put a, a headline up here I'll format that is heading one and I'll format down below continue with headings and I'll make this heading two and I'll center both of these I'll set center both so we can do that so here's a blog post. So just the, the basics of a blog post, a heading one, a heading two, and some normal text with various fonts. Now I'm gonna just copy it. I'm gonna hit Control A, hit Control C, or Command A, Command C, whatever it is on your computer. Now I'm gonna jump over into a WordPress blog. Hang on while I go set myself up. Now I'm in my uh, WordPress blog. This is one of my production blogs. It's actually uh, in progress, but I'm not gonna save this document. But I just called it Testing. That's the title, Testing. And I'm going to paste. I'm just going to click right here. I'm going to hit Control V. So I just did that. Now, I'm using the latest version of WordPress, uh, the 2021 theme. And look what it did. Click on that right there. It's H1. Click on this right here. It's H2. This right here is regular text. There's the bold. Where's my underline? Oh, I lost my underline. I had organically intertwined underline. But I don't think I have an underline font here. Let's see, do I? I don't have an underline. So it's just something I don't have in this version of uh, WordPress. Interesting. I have italics. Here's the italics down here. So I have that. And I have spell check because I've Grammarly turned on. So the bottom line is it works. There's my H1, my H2, there's my bold, lost my underline. And each paragraph is a block because I'm using the new block functionality of WordPress. You can see each one of these is a block. You know, also it's a block because if you move your cursor right below it, it lets you insert another block. So the bottom line is it works pretty decently. I don't see a problem here. Now I haven't inserted an image. So let me go get back and get an image. Let me do it all over again and put an image in here. You'll get insert, an image, search the web, cats, grab this image right here and put it right here. I'm going to resize the image down to small. I'm going to make it, uh, put it in the middle. Uh, I'm going to put a, you know, let's put a hyperlink on that thing. Can I insert a hyperlink? I can't remember. A link? www.cats.com put that in there and I'll copy the whole thing go to WordPress is my WordPress and paste that so when I pasted it my image was a little bit bigger than it when I originally had and I lost my URL that I put on there I just recently put another just re-edited it and put it back there again uh, I don't have my underline but I still have my italic so for the most part you can take document um, with a picture and with formatting from Google Docs and paste it into WordPress as long as your WordPress is um, I can't testify to older versions but the newer version or one of the newer versions of WordPress I'm Teddy Burris your Google workspace and Gmail strategist trainer and coach and I hope this is helpful for you